Hello everyone and welcome to a new video. Today I am going to show you all the books on my TBR, aka my TBB Red Pile, all my physical own books that I still have not read. You can maybe already see that I have murdered my shelf behind me and I was going to reorganize my shelf anyway, so I thought this was the time to do this video. I have more books read than I have unread, but there is still an insane amount of them. I finally have like a full, complete count all of my unread books that is now in my house. I have some like on the way and from Japan when I was there and also some I have ordered and they are obviously not here so I'm not counting those obviously. All these are in my house physically not my unphysical TBR which is my Kindle TBR which is a total other thing. Completed that is 400 and 86 books, which is a lot. It's almost 500. It was 500 at a point even. I'm gonna show you all those 486 books now. So settle down and enjoy. Only disclaimer I'm gonna say before is that some of these books are in different languages like Norwegian and Japanese. I would try to like, try to translate or remember the English title. They might have official English titles, but it might be wrong. But if I can't translate it, I would just say the Norwegian thing and we will move on in life. Also, I would butcher names. I'm sorry. It's just, it's impossible to be able to read all names. Another note, there were several apparently, is that yes I have some books that I have several editions of that I haven't read yet. So let's say I have three editions of The Name of the Wind but that is only counted as one book because there's only one book I have to read to be able to say that I read those three. I haven't read the three but you know what I mean. I will like show you all the editions I have of it just because that's how I sorted the book. So you get to see different editions. That was just what I wanted to say. It was really important. And that's it. Let's get started. I hope you will enjoy. 400 86 books. Let's go. A pile already fell and I haven't even started yet. White Sand Volume 1 by Brandon Sanderson. Casual Vacancy by G.K. Rowling. Electra Trust and the Evil of Librarians by Brandon Sanderson. Emperor's Soul and Legion by Brandon Sanderson. I also have this that collects the two of them. The Arithmetic by Brandon Sanderson. The Way of Kings by Brandon Sanderson. She split into two parts. Warbreaker by Brandon Sanderson. Bands of Mourning, The Shadow of Self by Brandon Sanderson. Dracula by Bram Stoker. The Archived and the Unbound by Victoria Schwab. For the Heights by Emily Bronte, Far From the Manning Crown by Thomas Hardy, Moby Dick by Herman Melville, The Adventures of Huckleberry Finn by Mark Twain, The Cash on the Rye by G.D. Salinger, The Great Gatsby by F. Scott Fitzgerald, The Phantom of the Opera by Jason Lerox, More Than This by Patrick Ness, The Ask and the Answer and Monsters of Men by Patrick Ness, Cirrus by Scott Westerfeld, Afterworlds by Scott Westerfeld, The Black Prism and The Binding Knife by Brent Weeks, The Copper Gauntlet by Cassandra Clare and Holly Black, The Time Machine by H.G. Wells, The Name of the Wind by Patrick Rothfuss that I have four editions of and I don't know why. Bergen's Ungdomsteater or Bergen's Teenager Theatre by Pedro Camona Alvarez. Love Rosie by Cecilia Aran. Marton Batona Almiel that has an English title that I don't know. Claude by Cecilia Aran. The Dream Thieves. Blue Lily Lily Blue and The Raven King all by Maggie Seawater. The Light Fantastic by Terry Pratchett. The Subtle Knife and the Amber Spyglass by Philip Pullman. Not counting the first one because I already read that one but I was too lazy to take it out of the box set. But You Were Horse by David Bussell, Red Rising by Bruce Brown, Am I Normal Yet by Holly Bourne, Prisoner of Night and Fog by Anne Blankman, The Rain and the Storm by Virginia Bergen, Glass Ward by Victoria Aveyard, Beautiful Broken Things by Sarah Barnard, Kids of Appetite by David Arnold, Me Earl and the Dying Girl by Jesse Andrews, My Life Next Door by Huntley Fitzpatrick, Me Brilliant Venina or My Brilliant Friend by Elena Faranta, Perfect Chemie or Perfect Chemistry by Simona Alkeles, Aura or The Year by Thomas Aspedal, The Evil Machine or The Devil Machine by Tom Eglon, The Kill Order by James Dashner, Artemis Fowl by Eoin Colfer, The Demon King by Cinda Williams Chima, The Dragon's Oath and The Fledgen Handbook both by PC and Kristen Cass. Three gone books that I don't know the English title for but presumably one, two, three in the series by Michael Grant, Over the Hunnelfjall or Across a Thousand Mountains by Reina 
Grande, While Schooled in Murder or Fiedra Nacinda by Elizabeth George, India Stata or Secret Daughter by Silpi Somaya Gouda, If I Stay by Gil Foreman, Outlander by Diana Gabaldon, Pillars of the Earth Part 1 and 2 by Ken Follett, Runestein or the Runestone, Dragefan or the Dragon Travel Road Adventure, and Frostrike aka the Frozen Kingdom, all by Annette Riese Hansen, Rebel of the Sands by Alvin Hamilton, Malice by John Gwynn, Seared by Sandra Gustafsson, Let It Snow by John Green, Marie Johnson and Lauren Morocco, Hoden or the Thread by Victoria Hisler, The Love That Split the World by Emily Henry, Eerie by Maria Dava Headley, Umpadura Stede, I don't even know how to translate that, Umpadura Place by Gerd Brantenberg, Sarens Juvela, The Tsar's Jewels by Tormund Hogan, Book 1, Book 2, Book 3, Book 4, Book 5, Book 6, Book 7, Book 8 and Book 9 all in the True Blood series. They all have like individual titles. I have them all in Norwegian. I don't bother looking inside every book to check the English ones. But yeah, from 2 to 9 in the True Blood series. Rosebud by H.D. Howard, The Kite Runner and A Thousand Splendid Sons both by Khaled Seni or Dragoloperan and Tusen Stolle Sola. The Unbecoming of Mara Dyer, The Evolution of Mara Dyer and The Retribution of Mara Dyer, all by Michelle Hopkins. Slammed, Point of Retreat and This Girl, all by Colleen Hoover. Ava Malieu, aka Inheritance and Environment by Vigdis Jo. The Silence by Team Liban. Reisen Yam or Rush Home Road by Laurie Lansens. Wolfheart by Richard A. Knack. The Gunslinger and the Drawing of the Tree, both by Stephen King. Hypnotist Søren, aka The Hypnotist by Lars Kapla. Illuminate by Amy Kaufman and Jay Kristoff. Monster, aka Monster by Jürgen Jäger. Vithav aka White Ocean by Roy Jacobson, The Golden Lily and the Indigo Spell both by Michelle Reed, Forsak på Verlykli or A Trial in Being Happy by Lorenzo Marona, Warm Bodies by Isaac Morion, Prodigy and Champion both by Marie Lu, The Fall of Five and The Revenge of Seven by Pitakus Lore, Soulstorm or Sunstorm 1, 2 and 3 all by Margaret Lerum, Behind Closed Door by B.A. Paris, Queen of Hearts by Colleen Oakes, Uprooted by Naomi Nowick, Holding Up the Universe by Jennifer Neven, I'll Take a Saw or Everything I Never Told You by Celeste Ng, Sheltering Rain by Jojo Moyes, Norwegian Word by Haruki Murakami, After You by Jojo Moyes, The Thirteen Tale by Diane Satterfield, Salvadorena by Cecilia Samartin, Los Peregrinos by Cecilia Samartin, A Legend, Allegiant by Veronica Roth, the Thirty-Nine Clues, Nokia Labyrinthen or The Maze of Bone, by Rick Riordan, The Shadow Queen by C.G. Redwine, Himmelblons Trea aka The Sky Bloom Tree and Aphrodite's Passang aka of Aphrodite's Pool swimming pool by Gert Nygårdshøv, Mellom Sommerens Lengsel and Vinterens Kulde aka Between the Summer's Craving and the Winter's Cold, something like that by Life GV Person, Lola and the Boy Next Door and Isla and the Happy Ever After by Stephanie Perkins, The Art of Being Norma by Lisa Williamson, A Boy Called Hope by Laura Williamson, Før Mørke Senka Sei or Home Before Dark by Susan Wiggs, We All Looked Up by Tommy Wallach, Girl Online by So Sug, En Blå Tråd or A Spool of Brew Tread by Anne Tyler, Barne Pican or The Help by Catherine Stockett, Vampire's Black Heart by Justin Stomper, The Lion Game, Never Have I Ever, Two Truths and a Lie or by Sarah Shepard, This Is Where It Ends by Marieke Nijikamp, Visning Pogo aka like an open house is ongoing by Sofia Sarenbrand, Fred to Victoria or Letters to Victoria by Mark Hello Puglia, The Letter for the King by Tonke Dracht, Scarlet by Marissa Meyer, The Crown's Game by Evelyn Skye, Heartless by Marissa Meyer, Wolf by Wolf by Ryan Grodin, Rogues, edited by Georgia Martin and Gardener Dosois, Tales of the Peculiar by Ransom Riggs, The Queen's Poisoner by Jeff Wheeler, Days of Blood and Starlight, and Dreams of Gods and Monsters by Lainey 
Taylor, Frog Kisser by Gart Nix, Winter Song by S.J. Jones, A Little Life by Hania Yana Gihara, Drömeskrivar aka Dream Riders by Gunhil Öyehaug, The Serpent King by Jeff Santner, Norse Mythology by Neil Gaiman, Harv the Mark by Veronica Roth, The Diabolic by S.G. Kincaid, The Forgetting by Sharon Cameron, Ghost Talkers by Mary Robinette Koval, Snowman or the Snowman, Pansayerta that I actually don't remember the English title for, Jan Fad, perhaps the ghost in English, and Police, which I have two of, all by Jonas Bö, Truth Witch and Win Witch by Suzanne Dennard, Guden or the God by Jürgen Jäger, The Lost Hero by Rick Riordan, Media by Francesca Sapia, Fire by Christine Kashor, King's Cage by Victoria Aveyard, Emperor of Thorns by Mark Lovren, Bobla or the Bubble by Siri Patterson, The Crown's Fate by Evelyn Skye, Gemina by Amy Kaufman and Jay Kristoff, The Color Project by Sierra Abrams, The Venus Curse by Maria Rutowski, Want by Cindy Pan, The Mime Owner by Samantha Shannon, Nemesis by Brandon Rage, Mufungu by Cecilia Samatin, Frivillia aka Free Will by Helga Jort, Traitor to the Throne by Alvin Hamilton, Release by Patrick Ness, Neverwhere by Neil Gaiman, The Darkest Minds and Never Fade both by Alexander Bracken, The Long Way to a Small Angry Planet by Becky Chambers, The Word for World is Forest by Ursula Le Guin, This Savage Song by Victoria Schwab, The Diary of an Occident Thief by Anonymous, The Fate of the Tearling by Erica Johansson, Because You Love to Hate Me, edited by Amory, Half a King by Joey Abercrombie, Emperor of the Eight Islands by Leon Hur, Hopeless by Colleen Hoover, The Left Hand Darkness by Ursula Le Guin, The Mad Ship by Robin Hobb, A Closed and Common Orbit by Becky Chambers, And I Darken by Kirsten White, Hunted by Megan Spooner, Side Effects May Vary by Julie Murphy, New World Rising by Jennifer Wilson, The Sand Castle Empire by Kyla Olson, Eco Rights by Terry Pratchett, The Valiant by Leslie Livingston, The Voice Man's Fear by Patrick Rothfuss, The Young Elites by Marie Lou, I'll Give You the Sun by Jandy Nelson, Great Expectations by Charles Dickens, Win Pinball by Haruki Murakami, Blood of Wonderland by Colleen Oakes, Empress of a Thousand Skies by Wuda Belesa, Jurassic Park by Michael Critchton, Quick I'm really sorry. A Fire and Stars by Andre Colthurst, Milk and Honey by Rupi Kaur, Office of Ever Lava Jean by Jenny Han, The Lies of Locke Lamora by Scott Lynch, The Blade Itself, Four Day Are Hanged, and Last Argument of Kings, all by Joe Amber Crombie, The Thief's Daughter, The King's Traitor, and Hollow Crown, all by Jeff Wheeler, Cress and Winter by Marissa Mayer, Oli Lissidago, aka All These Days by Tove Bråten, Bynesborg, The Town's Traces by Lars Sobi Christiansen, Glasjata or The Glass Heart by Torkil Damhaug, Before She Ignites by Jodie Meadows, Beasts of Extraordinary Circumstance by Ruth and Mee Long, Harry Potter, A History of Magic by Assumingly J.K. Rowling, Ever the Hunted by Aaron Summerhill, Passenger by Alexander Bracken, The Lost Magician by Lisa Maxwell, The Scrivener's Bones by Brandon Sanderson, These Broken Stars by Amy Kaufman and Megan Spooner, Astonish Me by Maggie Shipstead, Klokkemakan aka The Watchmaker by Gat Nygonsho, Atta Vintern or After the Winter by Isabel Alanda, and Tanked for Telling on Ban or A Thought Out Story About a Child by Björn Ingvaldsen, The Lille Piano Huse by Erica James aka the Hidden Cottage, Fanten og Sena with the original title Him by Claire Ampson. Love, Hate and Other Filters by Samir Ahmed, Winter's Heart by Robert Jordan, Dark Detectives edited by Stephen Jones, Lewis Man or the Lewis Man by Peter May, The Near Witch by V. Schwab, Eight Will Fall by Sarah Harian, Crossroads of Twilight by Robert Jordan, A Reaper at the Gates by Saba Tahir, Crown of Feathers by Nikki Perureto, Ami and Leo by Daniel Glatauer, Fifty Shades of Grey, Fifty Shades Darker and Fifty Shades Free all by E.L. James, Man Som Hata Kvinnar aka It Has an English title that I can't remember, The Complete Persepolis by Mar Ayana Satrapi, Love Hina Volume 1, The Omnibius Version by Ken Akamatsu, With the Fire and High by Elizabeth Akevedo, The Little Prince in Japanese by Antone de Saint Exe The Midnight Live by Marie Rutowski, Memento by Amy Kaufman and Jay Kristoff, Aurora Rising by Amy Kaufman and Jay Kristoff, Into the Crooked Praise by Alexander Cristo, Dark Dawn by Jay Kristoff, Winterwood by Shia Earnshaw, Historia on the Top of the Bana, The History of the Lost Child, not sure if that is actually 
official English title by Elena Faranta. Storsesta or The Big Sister by Gunnar Stolzen. Jenta selected me ill, The Girl Who Played With Fire, but I'm pretty sure the English title is different by Stieg Larsson. Inferno by Dan Brown. Dove Mora Stöv, aka A Dance of Dragons, part one by George R. R. Martin. Clean Getaway by Nick Stone. Queenie by Candice Cardio Williams. Which One and One by Elizabeth Gnonne. The Last Man, book one by Brian K. Vugan and Pia Guerrero and Jose Marsan Jr. Skeleton Knight in Another World, volume one, two, three, four, and five, all in Japanese. Marsh Comes in Like a Lion, volume one, two, and three in Japanese. Prince of Fools by Mark Lawrence. Red Seas and the Red Skies by Scott Lynch. Nuckel or The Key by Matt Stanby and Sarah B. Alfgren. The Sun and Her Flowers by Rupi Kaur. What? Oh my god! Bukken til Havasaken and Din til Døden Can't think the English title in my head by Gunnar Stolzen Serpent Shadow by Rick Ryden Autobiography by Christina Lauren The Trader's Crux by Jessica Pratt Ramona Blue by Julie Murphy, Luridium's Tyvan, Cryptal Portal, and Urabutulato Aganten. I can't even say those words in Norwegian. All by Bobby Pierce. All exist in English, I believe, and I don't bother finding the English titles. Dr. Denkel and Mr. Hyde by Robert Louis Stevenson, Salem's Lot by Stephen King, Aristotle and Dante Discover the Secrets of the Universe by Benjamin Allaire Sayas, A Wild Cheap Chase by Haruki Murakami, then Evie. Il, aka The Internal Fire, perhaps, by Ken Follett. The Winner's Kiss by Marie Rutowski. The Smell of Other People's Houses by Bonnie Sue Hitchcock. The Wall City by Ryan Grodin. The Girl From Everywhere by Heidi Heilig. Carrie by Stephen King. The Night Circus by Erin Morgenstern. Words of Radiance by Brandon Sanderson. Nye Veia, aka Perhaps New Roads by Marielia Orsanoy. The Liar's Key by Mark Lawrence. The Queen of Blood by Sarah Beth. Thirst, the Son of Neptune by Rick Riordan, The Weight of Feathers by Anna Marie McLemore, Postcode fra Hellas, aka Cartes Postales from Greece by Victoria Hislop, Helicopterana, aka The Helicopter Burglary, I don't know English, by Jonas Bonnier, Anton or Andre Flockty, aka Anton and other animals that I can now remember the word for that exact animal, by Gudrun Sketting, A Quiet Kind of Thunder by Sarah Bernard, Daughter of the Burning City by Amanda Foodie, The Throne of Fire by Rick Riordan, The Demigod Files by Rick Riordan, Vega A New Verden aka Vega A New World by Elling Victoria Unstad, Arcanum Unbounded by Brandon Sanderson, Zombie Uppruder aka The Zombie Acoplips but not really, Zombie Zombie Thing by Robert Nas, Ever the Brave by Aaron Somerell, The Knights of Crystalia by Brandon Sanderson, The Inexplicably Logic of My Life by Benjamin Allier Saez, A List of Cages by Robin Rowe, Rain of the Fallen by Sarah Glenn Marsh, Far From the Tree by Robin Benway, God Blind by Anna Stephens, The Royal Society by Marie Lou, Wayfarer by Alexander Bracken, Hardboiled Wonderland and the End of the World by Haruki Murakami, All About Mia by Lisa Williamson, The Song Rising by Samantha Shannon, Nevermore by Jessica Townsend, Ash Princess by Laura Sebastian, The Golden Fool by Robin Hobb, The Research of Once by Cressida Cowell, The Call by Peda O. Gullian, Renegades by Marissa Mayer, Ship of Destiny by Robin Hobb, Now I Rise by Kirsten White, Shadow Song by S.J. Jones, Fool's Errand by Robin Hobb, The Bronze Key by Cassandra Clare and Holly Black, The Republic of Thieves by Scott Lynch, Hero of the Fall by Alvin Hamilton, Witchwood by Thera Muffy, Ink Mistress by Audrey Colthurst, A Crown of Wishes by Roshni Chakshi, The Serpent's Secret by Sayatani Dasgupta, Obsidio by Amy Kaufman and Jay Kristoff, Mepaleken aka with the game, in on the game by Von Hirsch, Half a War and Half a World by Joe Abercrombie, Edge Dancer by Brandon Sanderson. Whoa! Havboka or the Ocean Book by Martin A. Strexnes, Shitteran aka The Shooter and Bloody Standard aka Bloody Beaches, both by John Mitchell, Fallafritt som en dröm aka Falling Freely Like in a Dream by Life G.V. Persson, Sattets sista hemlighet aka The Last Secrets of the Devil Wales by Santa Montefiore, Legion Skin Deep by Brandon Sanderson, Tornose Sov i Hundra år aka Sleeping Beauty Slept for 100 Years, Finn i Kjøleskapet a.k.a. The Woman in the Fridge. I Børku er alle ulva grå, a.k.a. In the Dark, all wolves are grey. Hexering, a.k.a. The Witching, perhaps? Svartefor, a.k.a. Black 
sheep. Begrav du hundar bita, a.k.a. a.k.a. buried dogs doesn't bite. Skriften på vägen, a.k.a. the letters on the wall. And ansikt till ansikt, a.k.a. face to face, all by Gunnar Stolzen. Furthermore by Thara Muffy. War of the Cards by Colleen Oaks. Oathbringer by Brandon Sanderson. A Map of Days by Ransom Riggs. And The Ocean Was Our Sky by Patrick Ness. Janta som blev igen, a.k.a. The Girl Who Was Left Behind by Jojo Moyes. Down and Across by Alvin Amadi. Starcher's Stories by Washney Chakchi. Starfish by Akemi Dan Bowman. Kumpis a.k.a. Buddy by Hasse Hoppe. A Dance of Thieves by Mary A. Pearson. Grace and Fury by Tracy Barnhart. Catwoman Soul Stealer by Sarah J. Maas. Queens of Fanburn by Kendra Blake. Heart of Thorns by Brie Barton. Spinning Silver by Naomi Nolik. Sorcery by Terry Pratchett. Utova and Valium Litfeel a.k.a. Without Any Doubt by Marlin Persson Giolito. Rebel Heart and Raging Star by Maura Young. My Plain Jane by Cynthia Han, Brody Ashton and Jordi Meadows. Pachinko by Min Jin Lee. So Europa a.k.a. So Europe by Gert Nygelsø. Byene Spo a.k.a. The Taos Traces to May by Lars Soby Kessiansen. The Last Unicorn by Peter S. Beagle. Red Sister by Mark Lawrence. Rigels Eine by Roy Jakobsen. I don't know what Rigels is but it's something something's I. Yay. Ace of Shades by Amanda Foodie. Legendary by Stephanie Garber. From Twinkle with Love by Sandaya Monan. The Fates Divide by Veronica Roth. Best Served Cold by Joe Abercrombie. Blood of a Thousand Stars by Rhoda Bellessa. Falling Kingdoms by Morgan Rhodes. Amy and Roger's Epic Detour by Morgan Matson. Shiver by Maggie Seawater. Land of Stories, The Wishing Spell by Chris Colfer. My Life on the Road by Gloria Steinman. Swarm by Scott Rustafeld. Golden Sun by Pierce Brown. Perfect by Cecilia Aram. Seen It by Sasha Alsberg and Lynn Stake Cummings. Skyth by Neil Schusterman. Sleeping Giants by Sylvain Nuel. The Power by Naomi Alderman. Eleanor Oliphant is Completely Fine by Gail Honeyman. Pudin by Julie Murphy. The Case of Stars by Kirsten White. Almost Midnight by Rainbow Rowell. Moon Colored Scars Awake by Leona C. Muir. The Shadowed World by Amy Kaufman and Megan Spooner. Goodbye Days by Jeff Center. Kalejata aka Cold Hearts by Gunnar Stolzen. The Crimson Petal and the White by Michael Faber. To Can Keep a Secret by Karen M. McManus. The Dragon Pearl by Yoon Ha Lee. The Summer Palace and Other Stories by C.S. Picot. Fire and Heist by Sarah Bathurst. Fire and Blood by George R. Martin. Grim Lovelies by Megan Shepard. Apocalypse Generator aka The Apocalypse Generator by Bobby Pierce. The Tales of Earthsea by Ursula Le Guin, where I have read the first four books in the series, but not the rest, so it's still on my TBR. Nimona by Noel Stevenson. The Dark Talent by Brandon Sanderson. Summerbird Blue by Akime Dan Buman. Song of the Lioness Quartet, where we have Alana the First Adventurer. In the Hand of the Goddess, The Woman Who Rides Like a Man and Lioness Rampant by Tamara Pierce. A Pale View of the Hills by Kazuo Ishiguro. South of the Border, West of the Sun by Haruki Murakami. Warcross by Marie Lou. Summer of Salt by Katrina Leo. Wicked Thing by Rhiannon Thomas. Meat Cute by a bunch of authors. Tyler Johnson Was Here by Jay Coles. The Book of Dust by Philip Pullman. The Shadow Lands by Brandon Sanderson. The Dazzling Heights by Catherine Magee. Sasta Klockena aka The Sister Bells by Lars Smithing. The Crimes of Grindelwald by G.K. Rowling. Fool's Faith by Robin Hobb. Killing Commendatore, however you say that in English, by Murakami. Everless by Sarah Holland. The Latest Guide to Petticoats and Piracy by Mackenzie Lee. Rebel Spring by Morgan Rhodes. Dance 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 by Haruki Murakami. Throne of Jade by Naomi Novik. The Wizards of Once Twice Magic by Cressida Cowell. Second Chance Summer by Morgan Matton. The Reluctant Queen by Sarah Bathurst. The Color Purple by Alice Walker. The Midnight Star by Maria Lu. The Devil's Thief by Lisa Maxwell. Thunderhead by Neil Schusterman. Snösestan or The Snow Sister by Maya Lunda. Anticlimax and Anti Climax by Siri Patterson. Nexus by Scott Westerfeld. Blanca and Roya by Anna Marie McLemore. Kingdom of the Blazing Phoenix by Julie C. Dow. Dutzangle, aka the Death Angels. Tree by Stefan R. M. Sörum. And last but not least, Bridge of Clay by Marcus Susak. I can't believe I did it! Oh my god! Okay, so that was my 486 books on my TBR. If you're still here, who knows? I hope you enjoyed this video. These were all in like random order, had them in order when I made the piles, but then when I was filming, it was impossible to keep them. If you have any suggestions of what you want me to read soon, leave them down below. And also some of these books I had for like 10 years 
years and I still haven't read them. And there's some I have like zero interest in and some I got like for free etc etc that I'm like why do I have this? I do not know. Whatever. I have a lot of books. Um, that's all for this video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. This took forever to prepare and to film. Now I need to fix my shelves and you will see me soon in a new one. Bye!